that real life kicks in and editing is gone, yeah, right? Yeah, I know. It happened before I started, right? So while we're playing here, do you want me to shoot one now? No, you have a shot. Yeah. Okay, I'm You've gonna take this this white ball, we'll bounce off this, mm. we'll bounce off there and into that. Right. Okay? okay? Sure. Can I spit on it? Do you mind if I do my spit no, ball? No, no, no. All right, ready? Spit on it. Ah, oh, there we go. See? See? That was really close, though. Yeah. And, and yes, I tried. Close. I'd yeah. keep your day job at mine. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Hustler, huh? <laughs> yes. <laughs> You're setting us up for the best. So, yeah. so while we're, we're okay, who's next? Tim, Me, you're, your shot. Tim. Oh, you, you got I'll take this. Yeah, I'll take the tough one. There. Yeah. So while we're here chatting, we well talk about the new record. Oh, he's going to clean the table now while we chat. Yeah. And um, smart ass. Uh oh. Ideas. Okay. We could just move on over here. Uh huh. I'll just leave this here. Uh -huh. My cue in the way. <laughs> That's good. Q cam. There we go. Q cam. So, what is there in Australia that that um, that there is nowhere else that keeps you there? When you know, the music industry is really here in North America, why do you stay in Australia? Well, not uh, you. Um, I guess uh, I don't know. I guess the, there's, a, there's a hell of a lot of distance between us and the rest of the world. And that's kind of nice. There's a lot more fresh air, I suppose. And, it's a uh, great place to live. Yeah, and there's. Uh, He's a, he's a weird guy just in a clown suit about to burst <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> It is Halloween. It's it is Halloween, Halloween yeah. yeah. We, we don't celebrate Halloween. You don't? Uh, no. Although we're just starting to now. I think it's just a kid thing, though. Mm, it's a holiday. It doesn't really have any meaning there. Does it have any meaning here? What does it mean? What it means Halloween? give me candy. I'm young and oh, I want right. some junk. I think you should just give them carrots and, and, and some hollow spleen. Do you have any kids? No, I don't. I, uh, as far as I know. <laughs> Uh, no, I, I would love to have some. Yeah. So so Tim, is the, Tim is the original father of the band. How many kids? Two. How two old, boys. How old are they? One's 11 going on 18. Mm -hmm. It's funny <laughs> how that happens. <laughs> sure is. And, and uh, the other one's six. And are they musicians? Just, almost, yes. Uh -huh. Well, I mean, they definitely are leaning that way. Are you encouraging them? No, it's not really. Good. It's just, I think, just my lifestyle encourages them. I don't have to say anything. In fact, the more I do, the, the less likely they'll become musicians. Yeah. So here's two people. Here we have two people who are very different, right? One, are they, would you say black and white or just sort of dark gray, light gray? No, actually, well, I'd sort of say. We may have very different lives, uh, lifestyle, well, not even lives, but lives, in as far as where we are. I don't have a family and all that, but actually we... We're, we're actually, soul brothers. Yeah, we get, we're, we're the Great. closest in the band, I'd say, just to band. The band's been together for 17 years now, yes. without a personnel change. Yep, now not that's, one that's, gun to a head. Now, how, how is that, what, is, what, do you, what do you do? How is that possible? Like, I mean, uh, marriages don't last this long. Well, <laughs> this is, yeah, this is like married to five men. Uh -huh. I, I guess we just, you know, we got together because we were friends, and not because we answered ads in a paper, you know, we never auditioned a musician or anything, uh, in fact, if we had, we probably wouldn't be in the same band. Mm. I mean, we started off, I don't know, actually since I was 12 or 30, so the band comes after a friendship, I guess, mm -hmm. that's the way it works. Because, uh, I guess the fact that there are three brothers in the band also helps, I mean, that, that yeah, solidifies so. it a bit. I think it's sort of, the, 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 the brotherhood, if you like, spreads amongst us all, or, or something, or maybe the... I don't the, notice the, they're brothers anymore. No, it's mm. weird. So I think we're fairly different, even though we are brothers. So very. Three of us are really different people. So people that are watching this the show right now, there's a lot of band people that are you know want to be oh, the yeah. next in excess, mm -hmm. whatever. Mm -hmm. They're starting bands. What would you? What advice would you give them to to maintain some sort of longevity? Um, I believe in yourself. Yeah, believe in yourself. I mean, do it for the right reasons. The music's got a, music seems to have become a, a means to an end. People ask about well, what do you want out of this? What are your goals? It's, the point is, is it's the music in the first place, not a job. You know? So, you know, do it for the right reasons. To do it for the love of music. Yeah. But on a but on a day to day practical basis. How do you get to it? How do you yeah, how do you how do you ah, maintain the, a balance? Yeah, that's the fine print in the contract. Mm. Yeah. The well, madness. <laughs> well if we told everybody that. Yeah, you can there'd be up. all these in excesses running around. No, no, no. There'd be bands that stay together. They might not play the same oh, yeah, kind of music as you. I don't. Yeah. Your respect for for the knowledge you have of each other is pretty important. I guess you know we. It's really it, it's really easy for for us to be to, because we know each other so well to make each other feel really good or really bad or bad. You know? it's, just, it's a power. You know, you got to respect that. Yeah. You know which buttons to push. Exactly. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. We've pushed a lot. Yeah. <laughs>
I mean, it's like you said, you can up, we can upset someone with just like that if we need to or get the right response. But, but we, we're even beyond that these days. Okay, know? let's see how well you know each other. I'm going to quiz you here just really quickly. <laughs> sure. What's his, what's his uh, favorite food? Michael's? Yeah. French. <laughs> oh, that's probably a French. very good answer. Would very you like, he you likes guys? all kinds of food. I like all kinds of food. Seafood. What, and what, what's his favorite food? Oh, um, ooh. <laughs> I would say I would say it have to be something to do with um, seafood as well. Uh, seafood, I suppose. It's seafood. Yeah. Uh, would you tell me if, if it's wrong? Yeah, it's yeah. Okay, all right. Lobster in and particular. What's yeah. What's his favorite movie? That's. Uh, I'm going to ask you the same thing, so you can think about it. Yeah. All right, you Eddie think Blue? is that true? That'd be one of them. That's yeah. a pretty great movie. Sure, and yeah. what about what would you say his favorite movie is? Last week comes home. <laughs> sure. No, David Ledbetter's guide to improving a golf swing. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. I'm He's so, a golfer. Oh, uh, the golfer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Are there questions that you would like to know? These guys are open. You'll answer anything, right? Yeah, it's pretty sure. open anything. here. Anything. It's just anything. you, me. Facts is the question now. Facts the bizarre question. Canada. The stranger the better. That's right. Facts. The number should be on.